Hello, this is Geotechland, and today I'll be playing Tekken 5 for the PS2. And these are the settings I'll be running, so the usual for this emulator 4K resolution. So let's get started. Alright, for those of you that remember playing Tekken 5. You always got this little intro game here. That was always pretty fun. Brings back really good memories. Before, let me set this on easy. Game options. One round. And infinity here. The King of Iron Fist Tournament 5. And I always select Brian here. And the one really cool thing I miss about this game is these little intro stories here that always kind of set the mood um, now those little stories were introduced originally or first in Tekken 4 and pretty much that was the probably the only redeeming quality of that game and it wasn't bad but Tekken 4 was significantly different than the first few Tekken games. I personally grew up playing um, or I started with Tekken 2 that was really fun. Tekken 3 was even better and I think the peak um, of Tekken was Tekken Tag Tournament because it kind of had all the characters from Tekken 2 and Tekken 3 and it was just really really entertaining and Tekken 4 came and it was very different um, had fewer characters and a lot of them, a good number of them were new but um, it just felt very different um, but the good thing is I did like the, the prologues, the epilogues at the end of those games that's kind of what uh, kept it fun for me I gotta focus now because she, she's about to kick my butt. Ah, uh, she did got me. Um, but yes. Um, Tekken 4. Well, after Tekken 4, Tekken 5 came in and kind of uh, redeemed itself. It felt a lot like all the good Tekken games, you know, the first two Tekken games I played. And then even I felt as fun as Tekken Tag Tournament. And Tekken 6 was still pretty good. I don't think it was as good as Tekken 5, but it was still pretty fun. Um, Tekken 7, however, that one was very... It was different again. Very much in same, the same way, or very much the same way as Tekken 4 felt different. But I'm not sure if Tekken 7 has many redeeming qualities. I may just have to play it again till I get used to it. Um, but yeah, I didn't like that they, they don't really have individual stories anymore. Or not in the same way. And final round. Fight. It's just one story and it's just Heiachi again. And it's just like, yeah, we're kinda getting tired of you, Heiachi. Alright. I got him by the whatever here. Now I did record this game a few times before and now one thing I did notice and uh, these ugly lines coming out of the game here I thought that was just a glitch going on with my system so I was like alright let me restart this but no it's in fact the game um, and um, it, it, they appear at the first time I played or was trying to test this game out it came out, you know, during like more towards the end of the game. 
but now it just seems to vary when it pops out but yeah there's some ugly lines here I guess it's you're not gonna get the full complete smooth Tekken experience here Um, one other thing I want to say is, uh, I guess we could watch this little mini story here. I finally found you. Alright, let me kick his butt first. Fate is decided by the heavens, do as you will. Yeah, so I miss all these little stories throughout the battles here. I think part of what makes Tekken 5 great is that you could actually play the original Tekken games on this game here. Yep, he got away. Another thing too, when I was first recording this, um, I was getting my butt kicked by the last boss guy. Even though I had it on easy, and I knew he was pretty difficult, I didn't think it would be that difficult. I actually was counting how long it took me to beat the final boss, and it was like a four extra minutes, so... I was like, yeah, I gotta redo this video. But it's not just because of that, but it was also because of these lines that I thought, I was like, all right, maybe it's just a one-time glitch. Uh, no. Yes, I got him. Wow, that saved us four minutes of video there, guys. But yeah, he was kicking my butt. Uh, immensely here So now we could just enjoy the little movie at the end in typical Tekken tradition here But yes guys, uh we play this game with these specs here we may get this little glitch with lines here um, And remember that this last boss here Jimpachi is crazy difficult even on easy unless of course you're a Tekken expert but all right guys hope you enjoyed the video if you did be sure to give it a like um, and if you haven't subscribed already, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you guys next time.